Hello and welcome. Well, I want to share with you a mistake that I made when installing my up here water cooler for the CPU, this little device just here. Well, when I first installed it, which I made a video of, and it's on this channel, um, I made a really silly mistake. And although it wasn't a problem, for probably two years, my computer started getting noisy, like a gurgling noise sound. Like there's, you know, when you get air in your radiators and they bubble and squeak, kind of. Well, I thought I'd share it with this because it just kind of just reminded me while I was actually just cleaning out my PC with the old airline, you know. Oh, you could use an airline or you could use, you know, some canned air or whatever you've got, really. A blower, if that's all you've got. Well, I'm cleaning the thing out and uh, I thought I'd share it with you. Now, the mistake that I made was that... I originally had the radiator unit, which is up here, mounted on the back plate. Let me show you a bit better than that. Bring it around a bit. Yeah, it, originally it was mounted here. Now, that was okay for a while, until it finally decided it was going to play silly buggers and drive me absolutely insane. Because I make videos in my office with, with this computer. And my microphone was picking up the flipping noise. So I was getting a little bit agitated about it, what was going on. I could tap that, and it would go for a bit, and all of a sudden start up again. But what it was, was trapped air. And after a while, the fluid reduces in volume. Whether it's evaporating or what it's doing, it reduces in volume. And it creates a void. Now, where you, want, you don't want that void to be is in this little heat exchanger there. This piece, the piece that takes, draws the heat away from your CPU. So the best place and the proper place to mount your radiator is higher than your CPU. In this case, it's now mounted up here. And there's the fan. Let me just show you. Let's bring you in a bit closer. If it's possible. There you go. <laughs> Excuse me. So now it's mounted at the top there like so. So any air ends up being trapped in the radiator and not in the heat exchange, which is also the pump. Yeah, there's a little pump in here as well, you see. And those, that noise I was getting, there was literally air in the pump. So anyway, that's my little short video for you. Um, so mount your radiator higher than your CPU. You know, the radiator for your water-cooled unit. Whether it's a Cooler Master or whether it is one of these little up hairs, which are really cheap, by the way. I'll leave a link in the description down below for that. Um, yeah, and it's been pretty good. The only problem I've had with it was my own stupid error. And I should have known better, really. So there you go, I'm a fool. Say to me. <laughs> anyway, thank you for watching. And don't forget to click like and subscribe. Maybe that little bell icon, because then you get one fuzzy feeling in your pocket every time I upload another video. And obviously, boot that like button, will you? That'd be most kind. Anyway, ta-ta.